Well, hello again, friends and fans. Pearl of the Orient, Rap is back. Welcome back. War game Red Dragon. Let's get going. All right, turn seven turns into turn eight as we end our turn here, and the Chinese come rushing down again. Looks like they're adding everything they can to the push, and it looks like Sai Kung is up first. We've got to do this all over again. Before we do that, though, let's just see where the enemy has exactly moved to. We do have a move that we can make with the Illustrious after the enemy's turn is complete. We have our uh, Anzac Artillery and uh, the um, Light Horse Battalion that's also moved, uh, or retreated rather, uh, tank support as well. Every district should have a unit in it by the time we're done here. We're at turn 8, so we've got a few more to clear the enemy out. If new territories in North District hold, we will secure Tucson Wan, and if Lantau Island and Sai Kung are ours, those two secondary objectives hold. So we should have all three uh, secondary objectives, as well as Hong Kong Island. So we should do good here. All right, speaking of doing good, let's get those Raptors online, baby. That's right. The uh, FSA and the Tracked Rapier have become the Raptors, baby. Hell yeah. I wish those were Raptors right there, those planes. But anyway, if you're enjoying this, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Tell a friend, hey, capturing Alpha. Uh, that was a good move. We, we moved up in the world. Uh, let's see. Let's get our Grizzly out. We don't have any more command units, unfortunately. We do have Chinooks ready. And we do have all of our units. Whoo, five elite. Oh, my God, that's awesome. All right, we shouldn't have any more points to spend, but we should have our, uh, yes, our javelins are ready. So we'll put those in good defensive positions. I don't know where the enemy could attack from the Kowloon area. These bastards are going to try to sneak uh, behind us at Tucson Juan. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up some defenses back there in this, uh, maybe that, that factory back there. So that's where these cheap javelins will go. If anything, they'll die, and uh, we can bring uh, some support units back there. We can just drive our grizzly back across the river. So we're going to actually put the grizzly back here. the hell? Game's lagging out a little bit. Is it because I'm getting too close to the edge or something? Huh, that's weird. Anyway, we're going to drop our grizzly down there, and uh, we're going to move our rapiers up, or raptors, I should say. Uh, let's move these into individual groups. We're going to put them up here. And as usual, the enemy will start as a blob on the corner, on the edge. So let's get our elite units out to deal with that. Game's really chugging here a little bit. Alright. I don't know. I may have recorded a little bit too much today. Maybe that's what it is. We've got hardened units to set up as well. It did this before, by the way, when I was playing on another camp, uh, on another uh, another mission. So hopefully, after we're set up, it's a little bit better. Too much recording, baby. Too much recording. All right, so we got our Chinooks up, and we should be able to. Actually, it would probably be best for us to keep those in the back, uh, those Chinooks. So once I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna move these to the back. Oops, forgot to grab that one. Damn it, I'm having trouble grabbing. There we are. All right, so we've got those uh, Chinooks ready. And uh, that should be good there. All right, so uh, the tracked rapiers are all set. Tracked raptors, track, track, whatever. Hopefully they track the enemy and kill them. That's really the main point. <clears throat> Hopefully they don't sneak into Bravo. So we're going to set up a couple of those in the woods. Uh, let's put one here and there. And we'll put a few more... Oh, I don't know. We'll just put them in the rear for whatever reason. Just don't want them sneaking back and capturing either of these zones. All right, so up next we want to capture Kowloon. So uh, we will need to... Uh, we'll have to be up to our old tricks again. Actually, they might... Oh, okay, that's what we'll do. We'll bring up these if we can. These four tow. And two of these. That'll uh, be able. That'll allow us to be able to blow up any uh, sitting commands. All right, here we go. Okay, ooh, where's the sneaky enemy? All right, we have Bravo at the moment, so we're going to move back to Tucson. Actually, we're going to stay right where we're at, actually. We'll move these units back to Tucson Juan. Tracked Raptors are not in a good... The track Raps are not in a good spot there. Okay. All right, looks like they did take the Kowloon position. All right, so we have our Chinooks in the back, and that's going to be a real good thing for us because if they're in the back, uh, they're obviously going to be well well defended versus uh, being up front, you know, obviously. 
Um, it'll give us some more time to delay the enemy. These things are very slow, though, as you can see. Very slow. But very useful. They have eight missiles on them, so hopefully we can at least land one hit knowing AA. Remember, when AA is in your possession, you're not going to hit any targets. But if it's an enemy man pads, goodbye uh, Typhoon, goodbye Raphael, goodbye Michelangelo, Donatello. What do you guys think of the new uh, Ninja Turtles movie? I don't. I'm not sure if it's out yet or not. I mean, I know of recording this, it is, but uh, it is not rather. And so you have to tell me what you think. I don't know. I'm trying to keep things interesting while we while we go slow with our tracked raptors they're on the they're hungry that's why they're slow they can actually they're amphibious too so they can move just like that all right we'll move our early warning detection system up which is sacrificing a 106 recoilless or a couple of them anyway and we'll keep these chinooks a little closer to the action so they're defended I said we keep them in the back from the start, but I didn't know if we were going to have the cluster F of aircraft or helicopters. We got uh, 767 points of the enemy to absolutely murder. Oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, those bastards. Oh, those bastards. Oh, no. Here comes the cavalcade of choppers. Oh, Jesus. Well, at least we're right on their attack line. Let's move this javelin over here. Hopefully, maybe another command will come out or something like before. Oh man, I can't believe they just drove around me like that. I put those units there specifically for that purpose. Now I feel like a tool. Oh well. Alright, so we got uh, these 106s ready. Track wraps have crossed the, uh, the river Kwai. Chinooks are ready as well. Don't want to move them too close just yet. 767. Oh, there it is. That's him. That's got to be it right there. Look at him go. Goodbye. You are the weakest link. All right. So uh, I, that helicopter was astoundingly uh, stealthy. We better move up to Alpha then with uh, these FSAs as well. Now remember, these toes are to kill any enemy, uh, any enemy commands that we find, and the 106s are for. Uh, trying to flush them out. That's really the only way we're going to win this one. ADATs, toes, additional toes. Here, there's a Z5. Oh, are you kidding me? He's going to shoot? How embarrassing. It's always, by the way, it's uh, the greatest shame to be killed by a command. Like when a command tank kills one of your tanks, it's always, you always feel embarrassed. Z5 is coming to Alpha, though, and it's also going to be heading straight to hell in about three seconds. Uh, let's watch this missile fly in on him. Oh, and he's engaged Romulan Cloak, of course, right, as my units were about to fire. Oh, there he engaged uh, Marshmallow Mode. Okay, now he engaged Death Mode. Bastard. All right, we're going to park right in front of his callout zone, and we ain't leaving. So he can go right to hell. There is a callout zone for Lima, but that's only for aircraft and ships. So all of his reinforcements, though they are helicopters, should be coming out on that right side at the Kowloon entrance. The 103 did not yet successfully flush anything out. It's basically like a dog. This is like playing the shooter game for uh, the original Nintendo, uh, whatever that was called. It was probably called shooter game. No, it was called Duck Hunt. Duh. And it was also, uh, what, what, what just happened? Wait a minute, Kowloon? What? Oh, okay, they just moved. All right. I, I thought they captured Alpha or something. We do have 129 points left. We're going to move back to Bravo to get extra money. Don't worry about that alarm. That happens. All right, let's kill him. These missiles just going everywhere. Jeez, all that crap just to kill a damn. Now, I could turn some of them off and do all this micromanaging, but no. I don't have time for it. I want to see death. Where the hell is this command? It better be, like, up in this corner or over here. In fact, I bet it is over there. Oh, there goes another Z5. No, you don't, you bitch. There you go. Oh, shit, that's probably infantry. Alright, just roll. 
All right, so we're going to get uh, uh, some more points. We need to, at 10 minutes, we'll probably have to go back and call out some uh, some more uh, recoilless rifles. In the meantime, we're just going to put track wraps back here. Come on, there should be a command right there. Somewhere, please. No, we can't even fight that unit. Alright, we're gonna have to get moving back. We're gonna have to call up more recoilless rifles too. To defend against those. The little infantry they have is putting up a problem. And they are on the move pretty quick. Hopefully we find the enemy command, though, over in this corner. That'd be cool. So the tow has found nothing. I'm, I'm, I'm smelling infantry, maybe. Maybe in that town. All right, we should have some Wall ready in a second. Come on, baby. We need you. All right. We'll roll up with these uh, rest of these recoilless and the remainder of the toes. Put them in alpha. They're much faster. Why does it always have to be me? Hopefully, this M40 can kill that infantry. I'm going to put that back. All right, so we're basically defenseless with no infantry. We well, we do have the Grizzlies, so we may as well use those. Uh, the Grizzly transports are pretty effective. And since we've already called everything out, and knowing the computer can do that, we can do it too. All right, so uh, let's see. Tucson Juan lost. Aerial Corridor was lost as well in that. Okay, what's the deal? <laughs> Where the hell did all that infantry go? I bet they're in that damn village. Need to wait to the end of the turn to call up more units to attack with. In the meantime, let's go blob hunting. Actually, why why are we moving like that? Let's just move on the road and then I'll tell them to stop if we. Now it always it, it always it makes me wonder when the enemy quickly decaps something if I'm close to it. Or if I stumbled, you know, if I briefly had a line of sight on their command. It's always a puzzling moment. Also, the fact that we can't see their infantry is a little disturbing. Especially since we're where they used to be right here. Somewhere around here. They're heading for our Chinooks, I'm sure. And the tow can't do anything about it. And it's going to take all day for those units to get up here. We've killed so many infantrymen with just killing helicopters. It's it's amazing. It's really amazing. The track wraps actually can move across this uh, this uh, canal or this inlet or this delta or whatever you want to call it, and uh, so that'll make hunting down choppers a little easier. Looks like uh, we found our looks like we found our our target there. Bastard, it's incredibly accurate. Must be infantry in that town. Or we're gonna get them. I don't think we have recon. Well, we do have some recon, so our, mm, it's better than none. So we'll bring these Chinooks back to Alpha for the time being. Actually, we'll gather around the center here uh, after those troops arrive. In the meantime, these track wraps are going to move across. Oh, hello, beautiful. All right, we did find, finally, one of the uh, commands. So a tow can head right over and deal with that. 
Meanwhile, there's, there may be a chop blob somewhere, so we're going to deal with that. So uh, this, by the way, if he if he tries to take off, we'll get his ass. So I'm going to just try to park somewhere where we can keep an eye on him. As you can see, Naval Sector Lima, he keeps debating whether or not to take off. But he can't. Alright, we've got a tow unit that's arrived. If the enemy has any vehicles, they're toast. Grizzlies arrived as well with the infantry that we needed. We'll empty them out right here at the intersection. And we'll push them forward. Sir, yes, sir. Rifles, uh, recoilless rifles are going to move up. Grizzlies are going to move up too. Losses are not much of a concern here. Time limit is. We should have enough points now for whatever else we need, recon wise. Tow should be on the way to dispatch that unit. Z5 ain't gonna be alive. Track wraps out in the middle. So if we see any chop blobs, we should have it. Looks like they've fled with their command. interested to see what it exactly is or where grizzlies are more of a makeshift scout at this moment we don't have any uh, recon as I had said but those grizzlies did get hit and they do see the unit so we're gonna move up here until those mouths are in position and the R&Rs can stay where they're at. We're gonna we gotta find that command. ADATs are gonna be worthless at this point. Infantry's where it's at. So we need another group of mouths and uh, another group. Okay. So the tow should be ready to wreck his ass and then tow him off the field. If you miss, I swear to God. Oh my god. <laughs> Horrible. Alright, so Z5 is down. <clears throat> Z5 is down. Thank you. Alright, so that's the end of Naval Sector Lima for the enemy. There could be plenty of choppers elsewhere, but reg regardless, we have our support coming finally. And it looks like what the hell just got attacked? Our mouths are getting attacked. Probably not good for me to call them in uh, one at a time like that. It's not about points at this moment, it's about pushing the enemy out of the way. We've got a lot of good infantry fighters. We do need to find the command. I, I'm not exactly sure what it is or where it could be, but if he flees, or if we find him... I just gotta check and see if it's a command or not. Wow, I really have no idea what it could be at this point. We got five minutes and our grizzlies are getting close. We need to find this thing and we need to do it now. Okay, that enemy infantry is not our only problem, but it may take more time than I think to actually push through that area. Why does it always have to be me? 
It's also disappointing. We should be able to see this unit at this moment. Looks like the enemy is fleeing to the left. Alright, alright, alright. I'll leave you alone. Got to be a command up there. I didn't. I didn't see one earlier, but I didn't venture close. I was a little afraid at the at the time of that infantry that was in that town. So we, we. It's not here. It's not anywhere down there. It's not here. So I mean, that's the last spot we have to go to up here. I don't know if it can be command infantry. Get the hell away from me. They are coming back. Get in that damn town. See if we can sneak this tow pie. There we go. Gotcha, bitch. Hiding up in that corner like that. No bastard. Total victory. Whew. Sai Kung is ours again. Hell yeah. Alright, that's the end of the enemy turn then. So it all comes down to Lantau Island. I think we could probably start there, but we'll do that in the next round. And until next time, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend. I'll see you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye. Password Pimpantrop.